Welcome to Key Tech. Please describe this channel if you are interesting in today's video. Countries around the world have very high expectations for Huawei's 5G chips. Almost every once in a while, there will be news related to Huawei's 5G chips, as is seeing the return of Huawei's 5G mobile phone chips. For example, there is news on the internet that Qualcomm has resumed shipments of 5G chips to Huawei, but Huawei Yu Chengdong officially announced that this is fake news and refuted the rumor spread on the internet. In fact, Huawei no longer relies on 5G chips for development. In other software industries and emerging industries, it has achieved great layout results, further reducing its dependence on American technology. Some American media said, China has been said goodbye. Huawei is the world's largest supplier of 5G communication equipment and has the world's largest number of 5G patents. Huawei's various businesses need the guarantee of 5G chips. Huawei needs 5G baseband chips to implement the core functions of its 5G equipment. The baseband chip is a chip responsible for processing important functions such as signal modulation and demodulation, data transmission, and communication protocols in 5G communication. The performance and stability of baseband chips are critical to the performance and user experience of 5G devices, so Huawei needs a reliable supply of 5G baseband chips. Huawei also needs high-performance processor chips to support the computing and processing needs of its 5G devices. In 5G communication, data transmission speed and processing capability are required to be very high, so a powerful processor chip is required to ensure the performance and efficiency of the device. In this regard, Huawei usually uses its own Kirin chips, as well as some high-performance processors from other chip suppliers. As far as the smartphone business is concerned, 5G is already the mainstream of the industry, and Huawei is still releasing 4G phones, so it is easy to fail to catch up with the tide of the times. There were rumors in the industry that Qualcomm resumed supplying 5G chips to Huawei, but it was finally refuted by Yu Chengdong, the executive director of Huawei. In fact, today's Huawei can continue to develop without 5G chips. Huawei has made great achievements in the software industry and emerging industries and has continued to reduce its dependence on American software and hardware technology. Some American media said, China has been said goodbye. So what kind of layout results does Huawei have in these areas? Look at the software industry first. Huawei's software strength is very strong. Although Huawei's core business is concentrated in the ICT industry, Huawei's software products and operating system development are among the best in the industry. In recent years, Huawei has developed a series of software system products such as Hongming Operating System, Eula Operating System, Arc Compiler, 14 nanometers EDA Industrial Software, and Gauss DB database. Through the research and development of software products, the integration and complementarity of hardware can be formed. Software plays a vital role in modern information and communication technology. It is the sole and driving force of hardware. Through the layout in the software field, Huawei can further improve the competitiveness of its own products and solutions, provide more comprehensive and efficient solutions to customers, and create greater value for customers. 
Moreover, the layout of the software industry will also help promote digital transformation and intelligent development. Meng Wanzhu, Huawei's rotating chairman, said that by 2026, global digital transformation spending will reach 3.4 trillion US dollars. This is a very big market prospect and business opportunity for Huawei, which has a layout in the software industry. When Huawei continues to improve its software R&D capabilities and release more products, it will surely become a big winner in the era of digital transformation. Look at Huawei's emerging business. Huawei has been exploring the future of the industry and keeping up with the trend of the times. Today, smart cars, artificial intelligence, smart homes, and the Internet of Things are the future of emerging industries. Huawei has taken actions in these fields. It cooperates with many domestic manufacturers in terms of smart cars. Huawei is defined as a smart car solution provider. It does not build cars, but it will help car companies build good cars. Moreover, in terms of smart car autonomous driving technology, Huawei actively participates in the research and development and cooperation of autonomous driving technology and promotes the development of autonomous driving technology by providing technical support such as high-precision maps, sensors, and artificial intelligence. Huawei has also invested a lot of resources in the field of artificial intelligence, promoting the development and application of multiple AI technologies, including machine learning, natural language processing, and image recognition. On July 7, Huawei officially released the Pangu Large Scale Model 3.0, which is a large scale model series for the industry and the full-stack technology is independently developed by Huawei. Unlike the generative artificial intelligence chat GPT, Huawei's Pangu model is not open source, and its goal is to empower thousands of industries. Smart home, not to mention the Internet of Things, with the Hongming operating system in hand, Huawei has the ability to connect everything opening the door to the Internet of Things era. As the American media said, they have been said goodbye. Everything that Huawei does now does not rely on the development of US hardware and software technology. Even without Qualcomm's 5G chips, it will not hinder Huawei's layout in software and emerging industries. As the saying goes, all roads lead to Rome, and there is more than one road to success. Facing the future, Huawei will continue to forge ahead. If you agree with the point of view of this video, please like it, welcome to forward, leave a message and share.